Hey, orange one here. So we're getting the skull back to bad teeth. That's that's the goal. An orange one. And we're going to do a little bit of base stuff. Um, looks like my cat's going to be joining us. Uh, little cat, you want to come here? Here we go. So yeah, Blake's he's, he's a farmer now, apparently. I don't know if it's going to give him much strength, but he does run around and move around a good amount. And old Barth here, he's uh, he's almost not starving, which is fantastic. I'm very happy to see that. He's operating some machine, though. He's, he's kind of slow moving, I do have to say. But that's fine. Got the restation as well here. Who needs food? If you look, we have not got bread there, but we've got straw flour that should be ready soon. Or, yeah, there's actually, you know, we're gonna let him harvest from this and then we could upgrade that, I think. Because once that's all harvested, that'd be cool to upgrade that. Or we could get another wheat straw field just going. Tangentially, because I've got plenty to make one. Let's do that. Yeah, I might do that. I haven't really added much farming here. Maybe we can have an expansion of our wheat wheat farm setup. Maybe. Um. <laughs> Maybe can we do something like that? Yes, we can. Russ will take care of it, don't worry. Both of these can get harvested. I think that that'll, that'll serve us well to have another field going. Assign that to you as well. Cool. So could you just take them in? Maybe do that again. And actually get me on that job. Do that right up there. Yeah, if you can. Let's get some draw fire going. Maybe turn that down already a little. I don't know. Let's get let's get some bread made. Why not? Got a random Czech warrior that's hanging out around here. This should be good. We've got Blake and Russ here. Alright, pretty sure that we could take on invasion if we had one coming. We have a beast trader coming, but no invasion. I think we might send, um, like, up somewhere, I'm not sure. here and there. And so we'll wait for this to go down to zero, and then we'll give it another upgrade. Grani raid, that's what I thought. You know what we're gonna do. We gotta be proactive about this. Yeah, get this plant down. And keep going. Upgrade that, please. Um... Okay, you're you're back here. You know, I was thinking I wanted to actually um not sure if we have the materials for that, but I think we do. So I'm pretty sure we no we do not. Okay. You're actually knocked out. Okay. Orange one, give that to Skull. Skull, you can get that set up. Oh. Getting a weapon. Excuse me? What? Mercenary guild. <laughs> what? I'm so confused. 
Why is there a bunch of mercenary guild people just in this building here? I talk to them. They are like, totally just bugged out. It's so weird. Can't let you just take our weapons. Sorry. Trying to take that Kazishi. Are you guys friends of us or what? I wanted to um, get a skeleton or pair of bed in here. I just feel like that would be a good thing to have one set up around here. We need five electrical components, four iron plates, and two copper. Okay. Let's see what we can see what we can get. Battle. Let's battle. Police. Residential. Yeah, there's a bar there. Let's we'll see what we can get at the bar there. Skull. We got that orange one heal a little bit. Talk to this guy. Yep. Just food. There's, oh, there's a trading outpost. Sweet. Okay. There is actually a store here. And it's day, so we should be able to shop. Hello. And... Got trade. They've got electrical components. Do they have copper, though? They do not have copper, but they do have iron plates. I think we need one, two, three, four, five. I believe. Was it three of those? Four of them. I need two, two more copper as well. Shame. There is copper there, but we'd have to steal it. Oh, look, he's got the copper there. Cool. We just need one more copper, which is eventually that guy will restock with that. He's selling it here. There would also maybe a copper mine around here. We just scan the horizon. Iron. Copper right there. We could totally get ourselves some copper. Pretty pretty quickly actually. Just by mining it. I'll have a nice little that up a good condition and then we'll go get that last copper oh what about that raid is that okay so let's go ahead and send blake out on a little preemptive raid off you go See what we're dealing with. Deal with it. <laughs> Blake's on defense for now. I mean, if you call this defense. I'm playing. That these guys are not gonna have a good time. Where are they? It says they're like here. This is, this is the real, the real noise. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Boy. None of them returned. Let's see what we can do here. None of them are 
with Blake. Some of them have gone off. Alright, Blake, do you think you can really try this group? I don't know. Is there any any animal or anything that we can see? Best son. Uh, could run them into the high village. That probably would work. They're all attacking. We get to see. Yep. Yep. You can usually kill one for getting hit. Good. Ow. Someone blocked him. Good on. that he'll be able to finish the slow off no problem. especially with the help of the others it's already like healed Good job. that first one okay that was a little bit uh weird he like it's an aggroing on these guys You gonna get one? There you go. <laughs> All right. I think we're good. I don't know what Barth was trying to do there. Get back in here. <laughs> Back to food. Okay. This is the. Why are they trying to do this? I don't get it. These dudes are kind of annoying me. It was that copper unit, I think it was on this side of the city. This side of the city. It seems node. Yeah, right there. Go there. Yonder. Oh, we've got like some good cybernetic right there. We could use. I'm wondering what we do with all these guys. Why they're here. I think the Shek might get mad at us if we attack them. That's like my main concern, I think, as of right now. So this might take a little bit of time. It's a low quality copper mine, but yeah. I think that this might level your strength. I'm not sure. Toughness, maybe? 
In any case, he's gonna just guess another copper. <laughs> we can have that electronics thing to heal up our electronics somewhere in Czech territory. I think that's a good a good investment. Functionality. Alright, I haven't mined like that in so long. Jeez. Seriously, I, can't, I don't even remember. Like, usually have so many things set up in a base. Oh, what did you get? It's just kill there. I paladin. <laughs> That's weird. An inquisitor. Huh. Very interesting. Are you able to go pick up that dude? I don't think he's gonna die from those wounds. Lesser men would. Not Inquisitor Sonico. Let him, let him, um, not be perhaps. Yeah. That's what I talk about in terms of some hanging around cities being pretty useful. Alright, so. What we want to do is the food station here. Go there. If we go here, is this one going to try and take your weapon? It does not appear so. Good. Which one's going to go do something useful? Are these people that we breed or something, maybe? They might be all bugged out trying to join us and they're taking our weapons. <laughs> cool. Um, there were more criminals. I'm, your, your own guard could be doing this. I guess I can do it too. Yeah, what's with these random mercenary dudes? Are they like humans? And therefore, oh dude, you guys are stubborn. Go get him, he was at least a grand. There are scissor hands. I mean, I'm not doing anything wrong, I don't think. I could be reselling their weapons, I suppose, these guys. It's fine. We're just good friends of the shack. Yeah, well, I thought I had ended a while ago, but okay. Look, another. I just go get relation with them. I think the Shek will like us a good amount after this. Yeah, I think that 18's not half bad. That's a good amount of bounty right there. Let's see, there might be... Oh, there was... Believe Nation Outlaws, hold on. Here. I just got that from the Shek for them killing these guards, so. I can make the Outlaws like us a little more. Those Holy Nation guards. <laughs> these dudes are gonna get wrecked. What are they doing? Do they not know the city fell? Poor traders. They've been on the road too long. Scaled goods. Oh, that's interesting. It looks like I'm not able to turn that guy in. These guys are about to, uh, I think, get in trouble. 
alienation traders. Pretty sure the shack are gotta be hostile to them. Yep. Good, good. good luck. <laughs> that guy likes long. The shack even lose one person. I think they did. Annoyed at most. <laughs> okay, now here's another thing. These guys will all have bounties on them now. For attacking. But I don't think that the guard's able to take them. I think there's too many um, prisoners, maybe, or something. I don't know. It didn't, it didn't let me last time. It's interesting. Alright, so Skull, you're in pretty good shape now, actually. Aquatically. Hmm. Oh, there's river raptors. I was like, what was that place? <laughs> That's probably a good move. Maybe you won't be one of the ones that gets brought in. Right. Okay, you guys are trying that. There's a guy with a crossbow, I think, looking right at you, though, so. Pretty sure they'll get shot. Getting themselves taken out. <laughs> I was gonna say, not much point in that. Okay, cool. All right. The river raptors are down too. There's what's his face? There you are. We're gonna. We're just gonna check out what they got on them. They might have some something worth taking. Sure, what we want. Well, that. Uh, oh, someone's got up there. Hey, look at that. We could have just used those. That's that's a good amount of food as well. And tools. Tools are quite useful. Can I? Um, let's see. Yeah, I equals one. Crazy. Maybe we could get a little research bench or something going. Uh, actually, we're not going to be able to build one big enough here. But we should really get some storage. One building material. Yeah, see that there? Yeah, I have any building materials, huh? There's maybe one on these guys, if not the store when it's open in the morning. We'll have one. Building materials. Materials actually. There's a book there. I'll take that. I don't know. <laughs> Let me put that there. No. Okay. I think that that's that's okay for now though. Maybe you can switch your arms. These guys out. Just for training purposes. Got strength up still. Doing your farming. Uh, 
100% is not bad. We'd definitely train you up faster if we sent you off somewhere. Dave Barth wasn't yet your farmer. Are you not able to eat cloth, right? Okay. Empty. I think um, you guys both need to work on that then. Make that much higher priority. That should be good for us. For her little bam shack. Yeah, I don't know. We definitely have a decent setup here, but now we have an, an okay one here too. Great. I'm happy about that. Uh, Skull, you could go loot those guys a little bit more possibly or uh turn in some more bounties yeah no that's that's cool get us another bounty <laughs> it lets me don't mind me <laughs> take me in prison United Cities doesn't like Blake too much. But what? Uh, Skull, no. Don't, don't be doing that. Uh -huh. Yeah, um... That, that would stop me, I swear. Okay. Don't ruin our reputation. The shack. Going so good. Burglary. Ah. Well, we gotta get you out of here then. the vein. Escape. I don't know why we did that. But now Orange One got himself a little resting location. You know what? You go ahead and just build back because it'd be nice to have three beds. Off you go. That teeth's got some power there, so that's good. And away Skull goes. If he gets knocked down, I bet he would survive it. Most likely. If not, someone could retrieve him, probably. If they could get one hit KO'd with his gear. It's a good gear. Yeah, send you back. That's the smart move here. 
That's how you don't die in this game. Caution. Overabundance. Caution. <laughs> Ooh. We're running right through a city now, so. Works. Bag check. No bag check. No check can bag check us. Maybe that's how the other one got to our base, I'm not sure. The one that's just wandering around now. Next to the rest of them. You know, it's interesting, Kenshi, although it's such an old game, works my CPU more than most 3D games. Like, it's a, it's a chore on the... You know, it's taxing on the machine. You know, I wonder about that sometimes, like, how certain games affect the life of the uh, uh, console, or whatever. <laughs> it's like, you gotta think, like, oh, I want this computer to last. What should I play that helps it last? some degree, I do consider that. I mean, I'm also like, I'm gonna play a game if I want to play a game, but... To some degree, I'll try and consider that kind of stuff. Okay, uh, where is our research? Here. No. We have a little one over here, I know. Um, please look at research. Is there anything I want? I don't know if there is. I might fire grind might be nice. Sure. We have so many of these books. <laughs> we get better weapon armors. We could do chain armor crafting. Yeah. I mean chain armor is like really good if you can make that. Gotta get the books used. Because we have so many of them. I don't know if we need advanced uh, medicine though. Not quite yet. I don't know if we want to do ore drill or whatever. Yeah, we could do an ore drill. Maybe. Let's think about it. I'm not gonna spend them all right now. Or if we spend the last of them. We'll consider how we want to use them. Uh Blake, I don't know what I wanna have you do, but I think I'm gonna send you up to Bad Teeth again. Send you off on an adventure solo solo adventure Blake time. Maybe grab orange one, bring him back to base. I think that um Barth is unfortunately aimless. It's sad. I want I want them to have aim. Um, that has wa some water in it. It is growing. I'm not sure if there's oh, that we could upgrade. We got two. We try and get that done. You can ask it right now. Be okay. I think we've got a little industry in the base, so we should be able to produce this. If not, we've messed up our wire supplies, so that's kind of an issue. We need to deal with it. Iron plates. We've got iron plates for sure. Do I also have? I do not have building materials. Do that if nothing else. Are you doing research? Um, skull. Do that if nothing else. 
Apparently, food. Makes a building. Let's see what's right now. I don't know if we have enough around here or on us. I think we need to make it. Okay. Rest you as well. Both of you on that. There's a ton of meat right there. Attack them up, provoked. Yeah, I know they're doing some damage, but we're doing good job. Oh, you're gonna be able to. Just here. That should set us up for a little while. Yeah, okay. Um, if we can put that raw meat in there. I think that will set up the animals for a good while. Oh, Blake's apparently fighting something. We want that book somewhere in the armor. There we go. I don't know why you've got bolts. When did I use bolts? I do not know. I've ever used them in this in this playthrough. All right, Blake's almost to orange one. His brawny arms, A ridiculous weapon. <laughs> Too much sometimes. Game. Good music. Good world. Absolutely positively insane. You better not be going in that water. No, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> that, it's a wandering drone. Lost drone. Sometimes they can join you. They're like one of my favorites to have join you. Like the true hyper start. Learner start. They may no longer affected by the pheromones. Yeah. All right, Blake. You're not wanted here. Um, we're going to the orange one. <laughs> and I think we're gonna head out. Boxes or wolves or whatever are about to die. To remember that bad teeth is where we've got our forward base of operations. We can also attack somewhere with Blake. Orange one's actually primed to attack somewhere as well. Or a military base, maybe? But if we did that, we really should um, get someone else to come up. Not skull, so it'd have to be Russ. Be nice if we got Russ to run up. Maybe Blake can want take out a whole place by himself, and Orange One can watch, right? That seems appropriate for Blake's character, the mighty warrior. Who carries the biggest weapon and is trying to get his strength up? What are you doing? Happy about it. 
I suppose it's okay. It's swimming up. <laughs> See, I had a feeling that there's something going on with the Pathfinder. This is why you don't trust them. They try and go in water. Maximum speed. Zero miles per hour. See their exact full speed is 11 right now. I mean, I feel like a starting carriage is not bad, but for someone with 90 stats, it's kind of silly. That's because he's got those weak arms. He's carrying a, a decent amount of stuff too. <laughs> I made sure that he's got heavier gear. Here, so. Oh, that's the cat sneezing. <laughs> I think we're about at 42 minutes in, and it's the meaning of life right there, so we gotta wrap it up. But I think that we've got a pretty good um, mission, and we've got a pretty good forward base at Bad Teeth if we need to pull back to there. I'm not sure what's going on with that whole military base, if we've not figured it out or what, but these guys are now well fed. It's the uh, a short version of it. Ready to attack. We got some dogs. We got quite a few dogs. Okay. Dogs and a military base. These guys are so dead. 20s, 11. But it's a pretty big base. So it might, might be difficult to clear out just because of that. But I am intrigued for sure. And look at all those little pups over there. Let's see there. A lot of them. We got two nests. Wow, okay. Alright, well we're gonna have to use those nests, I think. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.